Now, Channel 3 Early Warning Weather with Chief Meteorologist Bruce DePriest. All right, tomorrow's going to be a rough day for a while with the heavy downpours, lightning, and thunder. Some of these storms could produce gusty winds and perhaps even some hail. That's all going to happen from late tomorrow morning until around 3 or 4 o'clock in the afternoon. So it's going to happen very fast. But today was uh, not bad. It turned out to be a pretty nice day. We have a part of a mostly cloudy sky, and we had enough sunshine to get temperatures up to 58 at Windsor Locks and a high of 57 in Hartford, Meriden, and uh, New Haven as well. 57 is the normal or average high for the greater Hartford area for April 8th. A partly sunny sky over Torrington. What a beautiful sky with the blue up there and also uh, some puffy fair weather clouds. There's our ICAM in New London where we have a little bit more in the way of cloud cover and the temperature is 48 degrees there. Temperature wise across the state, a lot of temperatures are right at their high for the uh, day. Temperatures range anywhere from 48 in Groton to 58 degrees in Windsor Locks at the moment. And of course, uh, near the shoreline, we have a bit of a uh, onshore breeze, but over interior portions of the state, the wind is mainly out of the uh, northwest. In fact, Waterbury has a northwesterly wind at 14 miles an hour right now. So a partly cloudy to mostly cloudy sky across Connecticut now. Tomorrow's weather is still pretty far off to our west, and you can see some thunderstorms beginning to move into uh, Michigan right now. And some of these storms could uh, be strong to severe as we go through this evening off to our west. So tomorrow morning, we're in good shape. We'll have a cloudy or mostly cloudy sky. But then as we get up there toward late morning and around lunchtime, there you have it. Some heavy rain in the state, some lightning and thunder, maybe some gusty winds too. But again, it's going to move very, very fast. Three o'clock in the afternoon, uh, the uh, heavy weather starts to shift to the east of the Hartford area. And by late afternoon and evening, it is all gone. Now, going into Friday, the problem here is some rather chilly air is going to move in on a gusty northwest wind that could gust to 40 miles an hour or higher. And any sunshine will kind of self-destruct, leading to a, a mostly cloudy sky, some rain showers, and as you see there, perhaps even some wet snowflakes in the higher elevations. But you know what? All that's going to be gone by the weekend, and the weekend is looking good. So a dry night tonight with uh, a partly to mostly cloudy sky, lows 40 to 45, and your highs for tomorrow are going to be in the... Uh, the 50s, let's first of all take a look at the coastal flood advisory that's in effect for tonight from 11 o'clock until 2 a.m. That's because we have astronomically high tides due to the, the full moon that uh, just occurred yesterday. So highs tomorrow in the mid to upper 50s. If we get enough sunshine later in the day, we could see highs a little bit closer to 60. Here's your seven-day forecast. Friday, mostly cloudy or becoming so. Rain showers, perhaps some wet snowflakes in the hills. Windy near 50. Saturday, partly to mostly sunny and breezy, a high of 53. And Easter Sunday, it looks like a nice day with sunshine and highs near 60. Timing is on our side because we have another rainstorm coming our way on Monday. That could be a heavy rain producer. And for the shoreline tomorrow, once that sun comes out late in the day, a high of 57. Dennis, back to you. Okay, Bruce.